So what I'm about to do is to make some holes to have uh, my bass strings through, through the bridge and the body. And I'm not a professional. I'm sorry for my English. This is uh, I'm from Mexico, so I'm trying to this explain this in English too. So what I'm, what I did first is um, uh, where is it? So this thing was already here. Sorry, I just decided to make the video now and. I see, I saw like where the string was about to go, like where I wanted the string to go through the, to the bridge, so I can drill some holes. And then I make a mark with a, with a marker, yeah. So I just make like a dot, and then I did like another dot for the next string. So then I measure, I measure from uh, where the bridge starts to wherever I wanted to drill the holes. And then I make a, a little mark here and I do the same here. So it has to be like the same exact centimeters from here. Here on the bridge to here from the where the bridge starts to here and the same here so uh, this this time is a one point oh this is inches no so it's one and a half centimeters one and a half centimeters from here to here and from here to here and with the same uh, with the same, oh, I don't remember how this go. So I did a line. So all, so my holes is gonna be in the same separation from here. And then I measure, I measure from the first dot of the string, of the first string to the second dot. And it was, uh, Oh, about one one point nine centimeters, and then I measure like over the line, over this line. I measure like one point nine centimeters, and then one point nine centimeters. So the so the holes and the strings later is gonna be the same separation, and then with uh, with with this thing and a hammer. I hammer some uh, marks so so when I drill the the the, the drill bit doesn't slide around the bridge because this is very slippery or slidey. Uh, yeah, so what I want to do is to drill the holes first and touch a little bit of the body. So I have some marks, so then I will drill uh, the holes on the body, through the body, uh, with a drill block, you will see. So I just make the, the holes and take the screws out, out. So just those little holes for now. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna make the holes bigger with a bigger uh, bit. And I went a little bit, a little bit through the body. So I have a, I have a mark of reference so I can, so I can drill straight with the, I'm gonna use a drill block, drill block. Yeah, let's see. So I went to the thrift store and I bought this. It was about, it was about like a dollar each or something like that. And then I, I bought this 
drill block to drill more like straight on the base body and yeah so i'm gonna use this half inch drill bit to drill the holes in the in the back of the base to put the ferrules and this one this drill bit is gonna be for the holes on the bridge and this one is gonna be for the holes on the base body so it's a little thicker thick thicker on the string so that the strings just gonna touch the the body it's gonna so i think like that will be that we add more sustain on the bass strings and yeah so we're gonna continue So I make the holes, the pre center, and it's a good space from the screw holes too. Uh, I would recommend uh, do it with a press maybe because it moves, but it's pretty good. And I will try to take all the excess with uh, this file file yeah uh, and this one so we'll see so this is how the bridge ended, pretty much filed. And yeah, so I use this one to make it flat here, and the round one to the holes. And now we're gonna continue with the base body. And so I'm gonna use the drill block. And so the hole it's gonna be this one, one quart. So yeah, let's see how's gonna work this thing. Done. So I make the holes. A little bit of damage on the body, but it's good. And now I'm gonna take the all the chips with this thing again and make it more soft. And let's see. And then I will make the holes for the ferrules in the back with this half inch. So I made a sample just to check if the hole is going to be good for the ferrule. And yeah, it's going to work. So now it's time to go to the base body so to don't drill too much to the body i'm gonna draw a line on the drill uh, yeah just to don't drill like too much
so holes are done and so a little bit of the paint came off I will recommend that maybe I don't know maybe like heat so it gets soft first or send it to a professional <laughs> this is just an experiment it's a cheap base so you don't want to mess it's you know it's just my squire base and i want to a little bit like customize it and yeah but good thing the the ferrules fit very well so um, now i'm just gonna clean the holes and then put the string the bridge and the strings back to the base <laughs> I did a big mistake. I put the strings like in the wrong positions. The the thicker string now is in the bottom. <laughs> well, okay. So I will do it. I have to start from the beginning. So finished to put the strings, I have to tune the bass, but I'm pretty, it's good. So I paint the bare parts with the, with just a sharpie. <laughs> And it's good. So now we have to play, play it. And just remember, it's a cheap bass. You don't want to do this like to a, an expensive bass. Or if you wanna do it, like send it to a professional, so they can do it better. But it was good, just to do it by myself and experiment. And so yeah, if you like the video, just like it and follow. <laughs> Ciao, see you next time.